Welcome to part four of the IntelliCut AeroCut Edition Custom Template Training Series. The final video of the series will focus on how to use IntelliCut to program all of your template's finishing and cut settings into the AeroCut memory. As we've seen in previous videos, the AeroCut allows for direct communication with IntelliCut through your office network. This video will cover both programming your AeroCut through a network connection, as well as programming the AeroCut manually. Before programming the AeroCut, we must define any finishing settings that will be performed during the AeroCut document creation process. To add crease and perforation specifications, begin in the design area of your custom template and select Imposition View. Right-click anywhere on the screen to see a menu with options Add Crease and Add Perforation. I will select Add Crease and select the area of the document in which I want the crease to be performed. Repeat this process for all crease or perforations necessary. For greater placement control, select the Configure Crease Perfs button to numerically add or edit crease and perforation placement. Now that we have fine-tuned all required finishing settings, review your imposition view layout to ensure proper placement. IntelliCut now has all the information it needs to fully program your AeroCut. Simply select the Paper Cuts button from the Home tab to bring up the Paper Cuts menu, which provides the exact settings for your template that will be programmed into the AeroCut. If you are network connected, simply select the Send to AeroCut button and then press Send. This automatically transfers all cut and finishing settings under the appropriate ManuSet memory slot on your AeroCut, allowing for immediate processing of the PDF print file we created in Part 3. IntelliCut automatically saves templates under the same ManuSet number that is programmed into the document's barcode, ensuring immediate barcode support. If you are not network connected, it is recommended to take a screenshot of the Paper Cuts menu and enter the exact settings provided into the identical corresponding menu under the ManuSet section of your AeroCut's input screen. Remember, for barcodes to work, you must program the settings under the same ManuSet slot the template was saved under. You may reference the Template Used section of the Paper Cuts menu to confirm what ManuSet number was used. Because IntelliCut follows the same template-based system as the AeroCut, this custom template creation process will only need to be completed and sent to the AeroCut one time. The next time you wish to cut artwork in the same layout, simply Open IntelliCut's Welcome menu. Select New Job. Select the custom template. Specify bleed information. Open the project and import artwork. Create your PDF. You will not need to enter any setting information again into IntelliCut or the AeroCut, as both have that information already saved in their memory. Your printed PDF is ready for AeroCut cutting.